I'm uh, breaking convention a little bit by doing this because um, I, I don't like, well, I don't like talking about politics in general, but um, I definitely don't like to use this blog for politics. Um, and it's something I've only done really maybe one or two other times. Well, but this is a blog about culture. And uh, the issue is that in American culture, you can't really uh, avoid talking about politics right now because uh, everything is so politically charged. I was having coffee with a friend a couple of weeks ago, and uh, he sort of looked at me with this bewildered expression and asked, "When did it? When did things become this polarized? When did it become this 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 charged and this intense?" Now, the interesting thing about the fact that this particular friend asked me this question is because he was at Berkeley in the 70s. I was uh, chatting with another friend on, on Facebook, and uh, this friend and I really couldn't hold more opposite views politically. Um, he's very conservative, and he disagrees with me on essentially everything politically. And uh, he said that he was so angry at me because of my views. And I also remember... He said that, that he just didn't believe in this concept of bipartisanship, that, um, that, that basically one of the two sides had to win, that they couldn't, they couldn't work together. The issue is that in the U.S. there's really only two political parties that, that can really have power. And now in theory, other parties exist, but in reality, um, there's only two parties um, representing rather extremely opposite viewpoints that are allowed to really be in power. And that's an issue within itself, but what concerns me is that in the past, past couple of decades, I guess, I've, I've seen the, the viewpoints and the, the platforms of those two parties become increasingly arbitrary and increasingly polarized. Um, the, the Republican and the Democratic Party have become more and more opposed to each other, almost on principle. And while the Republican Party has earned a reputation of being the party of no and voting down everything that comes from the other side, just on the principle that it came from the other side, to be fair, this is something that both sides are guilty of. When each side refuses to listen or consider the ideas that come from the other side based simply on the fact that they came from the other side, then everyone loses out on potential positives that can come from those ideas. And then everyone loses out. Everybody has an opinion on how <laughs> their country should be run, and a political opinion is just that, a political opinion. And a lot of times they are very opposed to each other, but more often than not, I think they're really somewhere in the middle. So I think it's only realistic to expect that truly governing uh, a con the governance of a country is going to come from that middle ground. And the way we discover that middle ground is by listening to each other and not shouting down each other's opinions as much as we disagree with them. Many of my friends have very differing political views uh, from me, um, but I, I certainly hope that that doesn't mean that I won't, uh, that I won't listen to their views or respect their views or try to understand their views, because only by understanding where the opposite side is coming from do we really understand, I think, what really needs to happen to make politics work. <laughs> and that's assuming the politics ever work, but <clears throat> hey, let's be hopeful, right? So to my U.S. viewers, go out on Tuesday and vote your opinions and discuss your opinions and listen to others' opinions and Whatever you do, don't be angry at that person for having those opinions, because when we listen to each other's opinions, that's how we grow, and that's how both sides of the extreme come closer to the truth. And in reality, the government that we elect will be a hybrid of our opinions, and that's good, because that's how effective government functions. So let me know in the comments. What do you think?